Hello, gift goddesses. This is Robin, Philly gift goddess. And I am plugging along because we have had one rainy, rainy Friday. So I am looking forward to tomorrow. I'm going to be out ready early with everything that I have. Um, the van is getting loaded. I'm still plugging away. So I just want to share some of the last few items I've been working on. <sighs> I've been busy, but I didn't record. So, but I did want to share these because these are great for any occasion. They're great for um, wedding parties, birthdays, Mother's Day, but you name it. It's a great gift for her. And it's pretty inexpensive. It just depends on what you add to it. But um, like I was saying, even for um, a bridal party, this is a nice thank you bridal party gift that even the bride can make. And it can be tailored to each one. It doesn't have to be exactly the same. They can differ a little bit. Um, again, birthdays. You can add more to it. So let me just show you what I've done and I'll show you some of the ideas and the things that went along with it. I will put the link in the bottom of the of this in the description box of this video. Um, and just like the other, my last two videos, I used planners. One was the bench that you'll see back there that I haven't wrapped yet. And also the teacups. And they were from Aldi's. I did order these on from Amazon. Of course, it was a third-party seller. Um, but these are actually planters as well. This is pretty deep in the front um, where you can sit your items. Um, and then let me just show you the black one. So what I did was I ordered two white, two black, and two pink. And I think the way it came was one black and white. Were they two of the same color? But I think you can even get a black and a white one or two blacks, two whites, but they come in a pair, <laughs> just like a pair of shoes. So um, they come by two. I do not remember the price of it right now because had I planned on taping this, I would have hopefully got that out, but I will definitely link that as well. And if you use my link, it doesn't cost you anything, but I get a few coins as an Amazon associate. So if you do order these, I would appreciate it if you use the link in the description box below. And again, it will not cost you anything. Um, so <laughs> this is the stiletto. Um, and as you can see, it's really deep. Um, I mean, you can tell. So you can get quite a bit in there. I mean, even if you just wanted to do something really expensive, like maybe candy or, I mean, this can just have flowers from the dollar store in it um, leading up to the top and whatever you like. If it's a bridal party, you may want to do some bubbly in here along with things that go with that particular drink. Um, if you want to do like, um, what, pina coladas, there's pineapple juice in the little cans by Dole. You can do the little nip of rum and then maybe a champagne glass or, um, a wine glass of some sort or wine, a small bottle of wine and a wine glass from the Dollar Tree the the it's endless what you can put in these um again they do come as a pair but given one um already cuts down on the cost so if you need it to make a lot um if you are having a birthday party and maybe for those who helped you what is it um a lot of people did denim and stilettos was it sparkly denim and stilettos back in my party days, right? Um, and you can do the white ones and white and blue. And maybe 
give those to the people who helped you with the party. Um, if you're having a small gathering at your house um, for your girlfriends, a book club or anything like that, and you wanted to do something pretty unique or nice, um, but yet yeah, inexpensive and something that you can do very easily because it does not take any time. Um, put some paper. I put the packaging paper, just one sheet down in the bottom. And I can show you the one sheet. And I got this packing paper from Amazon. And I must say, it goes a long way. I don't even remember how many sheets, but it is still plugging along. So, excuse me for the crinkling. So, that one sheet fits really nice. And then I used one sheet of tissue paper. And I really pushed that down because I want to sit my bottles down in here. So whatever you want that's the heavy part. These I'm not using because I want to kind of bling this black out. You know, with the rhinestone ribbon. I used it last year, I think on Mother's Day. And it comes already, it's already an adhesive. I also ordered that from amazon so i'll link that below as well but it is really tacky it's very easy to use and you can really bling out the stiletto and that's what i want to do so i'll come back with that video so if you're not subscribed right now take a moment hit that subscribe button um hit the little notification button so that each and every time i upload a video you'll be notified and don't forget, please give this video a thumbs up right now. Just, just take a second. I'll wait. Go ahead. <laughs> so anyway, let's get into it. So I just want to show you what I did. So if you're doing one, you can consider putting it on a charger like so. Um, and it doesn't have to be. Keep the cost down. But Dollar Tree also has some clear chargers now with a gold trim. I don't know if you've seen that, but they're really cute. So it probably will look really nice on that as well. I haven't glued it down. I'm just considering whether or not I want it on here. And I'm thinking I'm gonna do one and just do this one on here, but the rest of them won't be. Um, so again, I have the packing paper below, one tissue paper, and then I have the Eucalyptus Rose Bubble Bath, and that's from Bascal, this one, and that was $4.99. Um, this is from BB, it's Vanilla Sugar Hand Cream, and this is just one of those packs from Burlington that had multiple hand creams in it. I just broke it up, so I'm using one of those. And then these are from B Pure, these are from the Dollar Tree, and it's a lippy. Um, it's just a hydrating lipstick infused with rose oil. So the bubble bath has rose, eucalyptus and rose. That has rose. We'll see. You know, we're going with it. I had one of these left over from Valentine's Day. So I thought that looked nice in there. And then this floral is a part of um one floral pick from dollar tree and i split them up into both um both of my pink stilettos they each have three pieces of or three flowers from the actual pick and then this is a um loofah from the dollar tree as well and that's because I have some even better ones from Dollar Tree that are much bigger. I know you've seen the huge ones that they have. But even in between that huge one and these little ones, um, there are some more thicker ones from the Dollar Tree as well. Also, Ollie's has a bag of loofahs. And I think it was... I can't remember. It was really reasonable because it was cheaper than the Dollar Tree when you did the math. So I had some of those too. But 
you're going to need the small ones if you put something big in here. I mean, it's deep, but it's not a lot of space to put a lot of things. So this little one works really well there. And keeping it on the charger, I'm just going to put a little hot glue on it. And I'm going to leave it as is. I mean, you can also take and put a lot of flowers around here. Um, I don't have a lot of pink flowers. I don't have any pink flowers except for this one floral pick. And then I have, I'm sorry, I don't have any more because I had two pink floral picks. Yes, and I'm using this one and I have a plan for the other one. So I'm done. Um, But again, so this can be very reasonable but look very high end, very nice, very chic, classy. And again, for so many different occasions. So it can be for a teen, uh, well, maybe not a teen in stilettos, but let's say somebody 21 um, and up, this can be used. And I mean, some of these younger little girls work, work walk so well in a stiletto, not me. Um, but it can be used, let's say 21 and older, and you can just put, like I said, put anything your heart desires in it. I mean, it can even be used for, again, a candy bouquet, um, a spirit, you can put some spirits in there. It can be bubbly makeup, um, you know, and again, 21 and older. So there's a whole age group of people that this would really work for and again i just love it as a bachelorette gift um for your your bridal party i just think this is really cute maybe on the night that you all go out um or you know because a lot of people now give their bridal party a few gifts because weddings are just so expensive and they Try not, they're either buying something really expensive. Um, you know, recently a young lady, she bought that I know she bought her bridal party Pandora bracelets, but she had a expensive wedding or she asked a lot of them, not that it was costing them a lot, but their time and effort because she really had them participating and her wedding and helping plan and they they just really were really good friends that they did so much for her so she bought pandora bracelets but she also bought little things for them that was very inexpensive along the way so whatever your pocketbook can do but this is one that the shoe is just the vessel so you can fill it with anything um Again, that's a, some, let me just show the other ones, but I really think these are really cute. Um, and then this one is what the white one. And what I did was I love my purple or my, bur my lavender. So again, I have the lavender bubble bath and that's also from Bosco. And I think they were $4.99. I want to say $5.99. I'm pretty sure they, they might have been $4.99 at the time, but um, I know they're still available, and they're called Simple Pleasures, and they're all under Simple Pleasures, okay? And then again, the Purple Loofah or Lavender Loofah, this one is a little bit bigger. I'm using the Lavender Sachet Pouch, mm, smells so good, and you can still continue to use it because you can just squish the bag and release the oils from the little buds. But this is 100% lavender. And these are, I think, less than 50 cents. I'll link that below as well. I got those off Amazon. And what I think I did was I got 50 of them. So you do the math, right? So I think it was like $25. Um, $24.99. And then that's my daughter coming in. Hi. <laughs> her last day on her internship from college. So 
tie it? Yes. <laughs> she says yes. All right. So, um, and then we have a sprig of lavender. And I don't know what this is. If you know what it is, please list it below. The white one, but the lavender buds are uh, cut from a floral pick from Dollar Tree. And this one is also from Dollar Tree. I do not know what that is, but I just thought it was cute. Um, and then I found somewhere to put it. So that's that. <coughs> Excuse me. And the other one is, the other lavender one is exactly the same. I did it exactly the same. Same loofah, sachet, the whole nine yards. Oops. This one, I'm doing a little bit different. Um, I don't have another small pink loofah. So I'm using the Soft and Dreamy Body Mist. And this is from Victoria's Secret's Pink Collection. So I'm going to use that. And then I'm going to put some um, shred around it. I also still have a pink lippy we can use. I like to sit this back here a little bit. Oh, maybe. Yep, maybe in the front. So we'll put that in the front. And it says clear rose lip balm. So that works. That. And then we'll put a hand cream in here as well. Maybe in the back. We'll use that hand cream. And then we'll put some shred in there. And that one's done as well. So really simple very easy and it can be very inexpensive to make again it just depends on what you're putting into them and that's it for me and i hope you enjoyed this video again please give this video a thumbs up i really do appreciate it my name is robin and i am the philly gift goddess until the next video bye